Hockey is back at Hastings Park in East Vancouver. Not here at the Pacific Coliseum, which turns 50 next year, but it's in here at the Garden Auditorium, home of the Hockey Hall of Fame's Legends of Hockey exhibit through Labor Day. 32 cases with 250 hockey artifacts spanning the decades with a special nod to British Columbia teams and players, plus a theater showing historical films. It's all free with your Pacific National Exhibition Fair Gate admission. The Breaker caught up with Hockey Hall of Fame curator Philip Pritchard, known to hockey fans everywhere as the Keeper of the Cup. It's probably the first time that we've done something this big in a, in a magnitude of, of something like the PE. And plenty to please uh, Canucks fans. Oh, yeah. I mean, obviously, we've got the, the BC flavor, not only the Canucks or the Giants, but uh, teams in and around Vancouver, teams in and around BC, and as you mentioned, players that are from BC that have gone on to, uh, to play a big role in, in hockey's history as well. But not only that, we have a, a great section on women's hockey, including the Olympics, uh, women's world championships, and, and domestic women's hockey as well. And, of course, the, uh, the honored members section, which features some of the greats of all the six positions that are played in the game. Yeah, so in one case, there was a uh, uh, puck that Brett Hull scored a milestone goal next to a, uh, an Iserman helmet. Yeah, and you know what? It's, it's always neat because both of them are honored members, both in the top 100 uh, greats of all time, both some of the best forwards ever. So we, we're trying to combine combine players and that together to give people a, an understanding of, of how they rank in this game but we, uh, for us each honored member is, is equally as uh, to display and, and that's what we've tried to do here for the, for the guests that come through the PE. and And there's a case just for Wayne Gretzky and in fact you got two items next to each other that are from the start and finish of his career. Yeah, you know what, I mean obviously Wayne Gretzky is, was known as the great one all the way through his career. He's the only player in history to have his number retired by the entire league. But uh, I mean Wayne's career started way, way, way back when he was three years old and his dad put him on ice and right through till uh, 1999 when he hung his skates up. So I, I think for the, the Wayne Gretzky fanatics, it's the perfect opportunity to see a great display. We have a theme display on uh, Team Canada's trophies, which include the Canada Cup and the uh, World Cup of Hockey. And then we also have a selection of NHL trophies as well. If you could take along with you to Desert Island and never come back, what, what three would those be? Wow. Uh, it's kind of tough for me because I'm the curator at the hall and I love <laughs> them all. We have the 1928 gold medal from Team Canada. Mm. Uh, that was the, the third Olympics ever that uh, Canada had captured. We have that gold medal here. We have, uh, let's see what else we have. Mario Lemieux Canada Cup jersey from when they won in 1987. He scored the winning goal. And we have a Memorial Cup ring actually from uh, Cam Neely, who's mm. a, a Vancouver guy. But to have a ring like that is, is, is pretty spectacular as well. But that's three of 250 plus. But ask me again in a few minutes, I'll come up with three more. <laughs>